boys, we have a lot to get done this video. Oh my god. Grab your popcorn, man, because it's going to be like 45 minutes long. Hit that smash that like button, because man, this is going to be a long video. We have so much work to get done. I probably shouldn't even be standing here talking. We have so much to get done. Okay, so as I do something here, I was back here and I was standing by that mailbox, right? I was standing by the mailbox. And look, you can literally run into mailboxes and knock them over. Like here, here, I'm going to break this one in half. This is how strong I am, boys. You guys ready? You guys ready? Oh, wait. Okay, that didn't work. What? Come on. Oh, what? I was able to... Hold on, maybe if I grab it. Yeah, okay, that's how you can break it. There we go. We lifted it out of the ground. But anyways, so all this mulch, we have to get spread around the house. And then I was talking to the, the guy, and for his kids, he wants a surprise project, and he wants a baseball field in his backyard. Which literally means I have to tear out this tree, grind the stump, literally put all the fences up, put all the lights up, put sand down. Oh my gosh, it is going to be a lot. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it all in this episode. I want to be able to do it. I need your guys' help through it. To, like, If you guys have any ideas on like what I should add to the baseball field, let me know. So, what I'm going to do now is fire up the truck. Oh, the Ford. It's a cold start, man. It takes forever. Also, so I got seasons on here. This is sweet. I got seasons on here. And what we're going to be doing with seasons is plowing snow soon like even though it's spring right now i'm gonna roll it and we're gonna be plowing snow in the next couple of videos or so most likely so i need to uh, yeah i need to get equipment ready for snow plowing i think that f the kodiak i don't i haven't i don't have the updated version but i'm pretty sure i was talking to hunter and he said it has a plow mount yeah it does so i can get a plow on the kodiak that'll be a plow truck f350 doesn't have a plow mount so maybe i won't get a plow on that um i gotta unlock this load quick there we go oh skitty she just went and popped up there Okay, so I'm going to use this good to spread all this mulch quick. We're going to get her out, and we got to get this job done, and then the real work starts. The baseball field. This is going to be tough. Like, I got to be good. I got to be creative on this. It's going to it's gonna be it's gonna be tough, guys. Oh, also, so last video, last video, all you guys, or I, like, it was the, it was the, the hurricane video, and at one point there was a Chevy, right? The Chevy went down in the water, and I was like, don't buy, I was like, just joking. I was like, don't buy a Chevy, guys. Look what happened to it and stuff. But seriously, I I do I do enjoy Chevys. Like I I I don't favor either brand. Other one one year maybe I'll like the Ford style. The other year I'll like the Chevy. The other year I'll like the Dodge. I think they're all good. I'm not telling you guys you don't it's not to buy. I was like joking. I was like yeah. Look what happened to the Chevy. Don't buy a Chevy. But seriously, I I favor all. I was like dude, the squad. I'm on subbing. I'm on subbing, man. You said don't buy a Chevy, man. But uh yeah, it, it's I, I favor them all. So we gotta dump this stuff. Like, okay, man, I, I I must not be good at dumping this stuff. If we can get her leveled out. Oh, come on. Come on. Get me back there. For some reason, I can't get back there. Okay. So, my mulch job isn't too good. What I can do is I may be able to kind of press it down. I think you can. Oh, no. What I did there is I just picked it up. You can pick it up by backdragging it. It's kind of cool. So, for now, we're going to be putting mulch. Out. Do I have to? Oh, dude, I might have to mow the ground. We may have to mow the ground around here, but I'm just going to spread mulch. Uh, hopefully, I can get it looking a little better, you know? Obviously, in the front right here on the cement, we're not going to be spreading mulch. Just right along here. Just spread mulch all the way around. Maybe I should take the weed whacker. Oh, I should have cut the grass, dude. I really should have cut the grass before I started spreading mulch. Oh, dude, I wonder if there's that weed whacker, whacker mod. We can take the weed weedier mod and just spread and then clear it all and then spread mulch. But it's not, it's not looking too bad. There we go good enough for now maybe a little more more around the house what are you guys thinking usually you won't use a skid loader for this because it's just tearing up the yard but we had to we had to use a skiddy okay holy crap dude did it spread all the way over there by that tree i think it did oh man i wonder if anybody's gonna watch the whole entire video because we have so much work to do it is gonna take forever and i'm gonna make it a really long video who's in it who's in it for the long run who's gonna watch this whole entire video every single second if you start watching now you can't skip you can't skip, man. It is. You got to watch the operation happen, boys. Okay. We're going to pull. Okay. Well, first we're going to finish pouring this. And then, what are you guys thinking? Go grab a stump right away. Or go grab the stump grinder right away. Well, I'm thinking. Maybe I should spread the mulch out a little further. There we go. Nice. 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 We. Okay. We'll spread her all the way out to here. Dude, I got. Okay. So, I got a crazy idea coming up for farming soon. Now, it is. Uh, I, I can't tell you guys, but it will literally be insane. It, I could either do, I could either make it really good or I could probably screw up at it. But it'll be coming in the next month or so, most likely, if I can get her done. 
It's it's kind of a secret. It, it'll be insane if I can get it to work. I should probably tell you guys, but I don't want anybody stealing my great idea for farming, man. So, we are going to just keep... Okay, there we go. We should... Oh, maybe, maybe I shouldn't spread mulch out so far, but it's fine. And then any leftover mulch we could probably use. So, also, I got to make a baseball mound, too. So, you guys... Hopefully, you guys know what a baseball field looks like. Actually... I mean, obviously, guys, you guys should know, but there is a baseball field on this map we could go take a look at to make sure we kind of got the design down and, and try to copy that, even though, you know, in my head, I know what it looks like. But, uh, there we go. We're going to be dumping this right along here. Perfect. Maybe, okay, maybe a little more there, man. We're not really uh, laying around too thick. There we go. Now she's a little thicker. Okay, sweet. We will put her over here quick. Dude, I... This cat skiller, guys, I'm never selling this thing, man. I always save this with all my mod, with some mods I love. I'm like, I'm never selling them, but as soon as a new mod comes along, I sell it. But this cat, man, this is a good skid litter. I wonder if it's available. If not, maybe I can ask the guy to try to get this one out to you guys, because this is a really good mod, dude. Like, it is, oh, man, I, I love this mod. I love it. Okay, so one more scoop, and we should be good. There we go. And then a lot of you guys like me doing first person in it too. Watch, oh man, I was looking the wrong way, but first person is really fun in, in it. I was thinking, I was actually, so we have a we have a real life skid loader, John Deere 260 skid loader. And I was thinking the other day, I was like, you know, you know, I was, uh, you know, obviously I was in first person when I was driving in real life, but I was like, man, farming simulator is so realistic. Like I'm operating the skid loader right now. And this is kind of just the same kind of view as a farming simulator. Like, it's pretty darn realistic. I have pictures of it on my Instagram if you guys if you guys want to check her out. Actually, we tore down a shed this weekend. Um, we tore down a tiny little shed, you know, like in the back of, a, back of a home where you put your garden tools or something like that. It was all old and kind of rusted out. And so that's what we did with it this weekend. Um, I would say it's good. Wouldn't you guys say it's good? So I guess load the rest of this in. We won't need the rest of this. Load the rest in the dump trailer quick. There shouldn't be too much to load up. And then now the real time starts. We need sand. We literally need everything. Okay. There we go. Dump her in all the way. This may be my longest actual video ever. I don't know. Maybe we'll break an hour with this. It might be long. I probably upload this video late because it, my internet takes forever to upload. And I was kind of behind on videos. So I do apologize for that. Like literally it will take me like two hours, three hours to upload this video maybe. Okay. And we're going to dump her here. Sweet. By the way, I noticed a lot of you guys. I see you guys. And it's okay if you don't have, like, an account and you're just searching the squad and watching the squad's videos. But if you do have an account, I'd appreciate if you, like, subscribe to it. it especially if you watch the videos all the time. If you if you want. If you want, that's cool. But if not, if not, that's cool, too. But I'd appreciate getting your subscription. It means so much, Mom. There we go. Perfect. I'm going to back this baby up and then pour the rest in here. Go all the way, and then start dumping her. Okay, how much more is left? Oh, oh man, I probably should have tipped it up all the way before I started backing up. There's not that much left. You know what? The rest, I could kind of lay on a little thicker. I feel like I did not put enough on in some spots. So, most of it, I'm going to just lay on. For now, I think what we're going to do is dump the rest of the mulch. Like, I'm, I'm just going to start like piles of dirt, mulch, and everything right outside my shop. So that's completely ready what i'm thinking about doing or maybe maybe not for this one maybe we'll just sell this one back what we could do there we go and so okay so you guys might be wondering like squad how are you going to do the sand and stuff for this uh for this project so what i got is i got the roller mod so i'm just going to roll over it with the tractor and it changes the ground to sand so it'll look nice it'll look nice and you can change the ground to grass which means i can change it to this thin grass that'll stay real like it, it's really thin uh, it, it won't grow much. It'll it'll look real nice. So I'm hoping this works out good. Okay, we got everything done here. I'm gonna need the skid loader here, but I do need, man, I need that stump grinder. I need the stump grinder, and that means I'm gonna. Okay, I think I gotta take the skid loader all the way to grab the stump grinder. Shoot, and I should probably drop off the excavator. Okay, so we gotta take all of this equipment back here. Oh man, there is so much to do. Okay, we are gonna fold this thing up. Oh man, there's a little more. Shoot, I didn't see it. Okay, the rest is just going to get loaded up in the dump trailer. Yeah, this little, little bit. We'll just load up in the dump trailer. And then we got to grab that stump grinder. Get her here. Oh, man. I'm wondering if... Oh, oh man. Okay, I'm just running into the dump trailer. There we go. We'll lift her up and then dump her down. 
perfect dude one thing about the skiddler is it doesn't lift that high at all that's what that's one thing about it, it doesn't want to lift high at all but it's, it's cool it works good it works good man so the cat back her up here dude it just ah, i i always say this every video i use it this cat skiddler it's, it's sweet man okay so right there go grab the stump grinder will we need the hex excavator i don't know i don't know if we will i could kind of leave it on the trailer i guess why not there we go it should be locked down. I think it'll it's locked down. And then we should probably take... There we go. Now start up. Now they're after 50 started up. Okay, hold on. I'm going to turn up the game volume. Also, I need to replace their mailbox because they take down like every mailbox, man. Every mailbox, it seems like. I always take down. Okay. Sweet. Now these boys are pulling. We are trucking. So what we're going to do is... I'm thinking we can go, we can just, we'll probably unload that mini excavator. I'm thinking we'll have to unload the mini excavator for this. Just get it off the trailer because we don't really need it. That way we don't haul it around. Okay, I'm, I'm just driving crazy. I should probably slow her down a little bit. There we go. Now pull in here. Okay, I cannot see through the windshield. We can't do any first person there. Okay, we'll pull all the way up in here and then unload this. Okay, man, the, it's either the truck or something. I got to turn up my volume all the way. Nice. Okay, we'll pull in here quick. And then unfold the ramps. Okay, unlock the load too. Because we gotta grab that stump grinder. I should have it here. I think I have it here. Oh, that mini excavator. Man, it's gonna go off the side. Don't, don't, don't. Okay, get the skiddler off quick. Or the mini excavator goes off the side. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me, Bobcat. Dude, this is a good, this is a good excavator too, by the way. Okay, so also, okay, these now these machines are really loud. Uh, man, maybe I shouldn't adjust the volume. The Ford is just really quiet. That's what it is. But one thing about this, okay, now I gotta just volume down. Sorry, I apologize about this, guys. One thing about this mini excavator is, oh, or I guess, yeah. Well, first of all, I love using this thing. And then the mini excavator, so you guys remember when I dug out the pool, literally first construction video on this map. If you guys looked over there during it, the pool wasn't dug out anymore. It's because I had to like switch to all new maps. And so the pool wasn't dug out at all over there. So you guys might be like, whoa, I, I, I bet somebody caught that. Somebody probably caught that in the video. Comment it, comment if you caught that, if you saw that. It would have been when I'm working at that house up there. You probably saw the hole was still, or there was, it was covered up with dirt. It was all filled in with dirt, which it should have been dug out. Because I remember kind of put in a pool there. Okay, I think all we'll need is a stump grinder, right? Man, I feel like I may need the bucket. Okay, we're going to keep the bucket up there. Yeah, just for safety reasons. Safety reasons mean I don't, I'm kind of lazy. I don't want to have to come back for it. It's safety reasons. What I'm talking about. So, we're going to drop this thing down here. There we go. And then go grab the stump grinder and load it up. Dude, I still can't get over it. Like, you guys probably hear me say in this a lot of videos, but... This is farming simulator, guys. This is farming simulator. And we are just doing all types of stuff. We're literally going to be plowing snow. We're literally doing construction, digging out pools. This game is insane. I can't get over it. It was released like two years ago, and we're still playing it a ton. It's an awesome game. So, we're going to put her up here. And then, is, are we going to hit the bucket? Nope. Perfect. Right there. Sweet. So now, lock the load down. Is it locked? I think it, I think I locked it down. And then it's time to get on the road, Jack. That 350, it's been a good truck. It's got, it's got, uh, we bulletproof the engine. So it should go 400,000 miles or so. You know, the 6.0s, the, the power strokes aren't, are known to not be good, but they sound sweet, but they're, they're, they're not good engines. So we bulletproofed it. We just got all new, everything, basically in the engine, everything replaced. Um, so it's not a stock engine at all. This thing should go a while for squat construction, Kale. Oh boy. Back her up. Oh, there we go. Perfect. And now we got to go grab. So the 4520. Yeah, the 4520. We got to bring. Or is it, yeah, I think it's 4520. We got to bring over here and start rolling that grass. But first, the first thing is we got to get that tree out of the way. What we really got to get done. And by the way, so I'm going to be doing snow plowing videos soon here. Any recommendations on what we should get for like snow plow, snow plow setup? Should we get a wheel loader? Should we get a skid loader? I'm thinking about getting a box pusher for the skid loader, which would be perfect. So if you guys have any recommendations, let me know, boys. Okay, we're backing this bad boy in here. And then I'm going to, well, first of all, we'll go right there. Perfect. And then I'm going to unfold this, unlock the load. 
And then start going cutting that tree real quick. Okay, I should probably shut off the truck. There we go. Okay. Skiddy. Start the skiddy up. There we go. Oh, man. The, something must have been wrong with that ramp over there. So now, cut the tree down. We're 15 minutes into the video, and man, did we have even got started on the baseball field. Finally, we're starting it. So I'm going to cut it down, and I'm just going to push the tree back to the back lot, unless what I should have done is I should have grinded up the tree and used it for wood chips. Save me money, and they won't have a just dead tree sitting back there. So right now, I'll run down her quick. And then first, I'm going to grind that stump real quick, and then we'll push her. Okay. Turn her on. It should be on. There we go. It's on. It's definitely on. Start grinding this stump. <coughs> Perfect. Grind this thing and I'll move it back and forth. Oh, wait. Okay, now go down. Go down further. Right about there. Did we get her grinded? I think we did. Okay, perfect. So now what we're going to do is I'm just going to throw this stump grinder right here. And I know this is, I, I probably should be using forks or something, but what I'm going to do is put, push this log. We'll push it all the way into the forest. It usually works pretty good doing it like this. There we go. I mean, this plate is insanely strong. You, like in real life, it, you, you could easily do this. So it's, it should be fine. Oh man, this thing whips around on me. Now I'm stuck. It's good. There's like pinned underneath it. There we go. And now we can push her up against this tree. And we got ourselves a baseball diamond coming up. Oh, by the way, I'm going to add lights to it too. Like it's going to be sweet. Like I'm going to get placeable lights, placeable fence. This thing is going to be amazing. Like I was like, you know what? That'd be cool to build the baseball field. I was like, dude, we have all the mods, and I kept thinking of mods. Oh, the lights, the fence. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be sweet. So, that's what we got going. Man, I should probably fire this thing up and connect it to the stump grinder. I forgot. And then we'll get the stump grinder out of here. So, what's the next thing? I'm thinking the roller in the sand. So, where should we put it? Should we put it like right here? I'm thinking right here. Like, you got your fence over here. Like, we'll fence in the whole thing, I'm thinking. But this seems like it'd be good. So if we go out here and then the, the the home run fence is just way out there. It'll kind of take up the neighbor's yard out there. But thinking this will work. What is this? All these stakes. Okay, we should be good. I think it's just marking like the forest or, or boundaries or something like that. So yeah, we can we can put this thing in. This will work. I'm not going to have like really a true backstop. Stop. That's one thing I probably should have put thought about. But it's fine. So... I guess I could hold the 4520 over here. I just thought, oh man, are we just stuck? Come on. Oh, dude, there's something like placeable there. It was getting caught on something. Okay, perfect. Scoodler's going here. We'll probably need again, but for now, I'll load it up on the trailer. Uh, the 4520. We gotta get this thing out. Okay, you guys saw my Bronco that I still have not tipped over. Oh, maybe it's... Where is the 4520? There. Wait. There it is. Perfect. And now, so we can remove the grass, which I probably don't want. Remove grass, yes. Remove grass, no. Ground type. Cultivated, plowed, sowed. Sowed wide. Grass field is what I'm thinking we want. I want to see, what, well, first of all, I probably shouldn't be testing it here, but I want to see what this creates. So, say I... Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. It doesn't really do much. It kind of makes the grass look a little better, though. So I'm probably going to do that for a grass field. It'll make it look a little better. Can I do sand though? That's the thing. Asphalt. Sand. Yeah, baby. We can do sand. Sweet. Okay, this can be this can be perfect. Dude, I played baseball a ton in my days. Like all, almost all through high school. And uh, one thing is like when I was little, I remember playing on like basically gravel fields where it was literally like rocks of gravel and you just go sliding. And it, 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 was, a, it was a little tough. There's some crappy baseball fields I remember back in the day. It was just basically sliding on rocks. It was kind of, it was fun. It was interesting though. So, 45, 20. She's going to get the job done. I should probably be using like a smaller tractor right now. I feel like I really should be using a smaller tractor. But, 45, 20, I, it, it's like, it's kind of too big. I feel like it'll tear up the yard. Uh, but, it's an old tractor. It's a cheap tractor. It seems like it'll, it'll do just fine. So, um, okay, I probably shouldn't be pulling through their main yard. We'll just kind of pull off to the side over here. So, here's where we go. Here's where it all starts. This Okay, I'm going to be honest. Before I, before I do anything, don't judge me too much because this may look bad. I'm going to try my best here, though. We will try our best to create this thing. Okay, so 
for example, what I need to do now is I need to do the border. Okay, I am going to make... Okay, oh man, okay, I'm going to save the game in case I really screw up. So I'm going to make a... Man, okay. Okay, I'm just going to drive the border for now. Just literally drive it. So for example, this is the home run fence out here. It goes way out here. There we go. So this is like the home run fence. Maybe I should make it a little wider. This is partially going in their yard. That's what I was talking about. I, de I, 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 I dug that out. And now it's just there. Okay, so. Say we start the field right here. So. Since this is going to be the back wall. We are going to put down. Oh, pine needles. That's sweet. Gravel. Cause, or some type of rock. Oh, oh, you can put. Okay, what is rock? Mud. No way, dude. Plates? What, is, what are plates? Dirt. Meadow, lawn, original ground, cultivated. Okay, this is sweet. Okay, hopefully I don't screw it up too bad. Uh, should we just go sand in the back? We'll put rock. I don't know what rock is. Oh, man, we just skipped rock. I don't know what rock is, but I'm going to try to put it down. I'm going to try to put rock down. Pine needles. What are... Man, i got to test out all these. Leaves. Rock. Okay, here it is. So the warning track, if you guys know what that is. It's like the thing before the fence, and it tells the outfielder, like... Oh, you're hitting, you're, you're stepping in rocks right now. You're about to hit the fence. Because, you know, they're looking up at a fly ball or something. So, we're going to drop this thing down. Okay, rocks not bad. Okay, how big are rocks, though? Oh, okay, that is true rock. Okay, no, we are not doing, we are not doing that type of rock. We don't want mud, plates, dirt. We can put dirt. Lawn, original ground, cultivated, plowed, sowed, sowed wide, grass field, asphalt, sand let's just do sand i think sand would work good so we're gonna repaint over this put sand all around here so this is the warning track oh you know what we should get rid of the uh yeah definitely let's get rid of the grass we do want to remove the grass oh yeah oh yeah okay i gotta make this here's my only shot man here's my only shot okay we gotta go i don't know i don't know how this is gonna turn out this is there we go there we go Oh, man, this is kind of wide. I should have got a smaller one. How am I going to do the bases, though, too? Okay, this is going to be more of a softball field, probably. There we go. Sweet. Okay. Uh, let's lift her up. Sweet. So that's the warning track. That's like the outfield. So now I got to do this infield. Oh, man. Okay, so it looks like we could start the infield right here. Right about. Okay, it's going to literally go right along the house. But it's fine. Yeah, okay, here we go. We're going to drop her down. Oh, man. This is going to be tough. Okay. um, Are we lined up? <laughs> so what? Here we go. Okay. I, I got to think about this. Usually, you'd have a tiny bit of grass in field. So, it's fine. I, I think I can do this. So, this is the the baseline right here. We're not going to make it too far. Because, that like, literally, that's the outfield then. So, do I cut it in? Yeah. I'm going to lift it up, actually. There we go. If not, I can I can kind of expand this a little bit. Okay, we're not going to have a fence alongside the house. This is like homemade backyard stuff. Okay, so now it's going to cut. Man, I got to think about this. Oh my gosh, okay. It'll cut around here. There we go. Come on, squad. You got to do better, man. Okay, we'll st we're starting to turn. There we go. It's going to be kind of a small baseball field. It's fine, though. There we go. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, right there. <coughs> Perfect. And then now we're just going to go straight up right here. <coughs> okay, we're going to go all the way here. Okay, I don't know. Should I put bases in? I could put like little... Uh, man, how would I put bases? I got to think of how to put them out. Okay, so that's the baseball field so far. Is there anything else I'm missing? Okay, usually this is a little bit wider. So what we'll do is I'm going to come back here and make this a lot bigger. There we go. And then I'm going to take away some of this grass through here. There we go. Okay, this is a little too... Oh, it's good enough. Okay, this is going to be kind of small. But it's fine. Sweet. Okay, so we got that done. We do need a pitcher's mound. Which the pitcher's mound, for example, is just going to go right here. That's the outfield. I should probably put in the warning... Or the, the fence back there. What's the next... Okay, I guess fence. So if we got everything here... I'm going to kind of... Okay, I'm going to turn the grass like different color. So, watch how I do this. So, remove the grass, and then I'm going to put grass down. Um, I'm going to put... Oh, man, I skipped grass. Ooh. 
Oh, okay. Skip to grass again. Oh, wait. Okay, there's grass. Sweet. What's the difference between grass field and grass? Okay, anyways, it's fine. Probably doesn't matter too much. So, we're going to put grass down. I don't know how this is going to work, but we'll see, I guess. Oh. Oh, this is going to look sick, dude. Okay, that way we'll get all that, like, big tall grass out of the way. Oh, man, this is going to look sweet. It's just going to be like a turf field. Oh, dude, look at this. This is going to be sweet. Okay, we'll just keep rolling along here. That means we got to do this to the whole entire field. 45-20, she's getting her done. Okay, no. Yeah, 45-20. She's getting her done, baby. There we go. And then now, usually you'd have some type of warning track, I guess, but it's fine. So now I'm going to go all the way back around there. Do this. Oh, man, this is going to be sweet. Okay, so we'll drop her down here. Dude, you guys should try this. You guys should really try this, especially if you're on PC and Farm Simulator, trying to construct a baseball field. Okay, we got her there. I need to put the fence up yet, too. We got a lot to do. Okay, I'm going to save the game in case, like, my power goes out or something and then gets all screwed up. Perfect. There we go. Okay. And then we'll lift her up. Oh, this is going to look sweet. You know what? Maybe I should have kept it that grass. I don't know. That's fine, I guess. Yeah, I think I should have kind of kept it as that grass. We'll only do the outfield. Maybe we'll keep the infield as, like, I don't know. It's fine, though. It should be fine. Yeah, I probably should have kept it. That way we could have mowed it and stuff, and I would have had to mow the baseball field. Man, we okay. It's fine. It, it's fine. Okay. So, I don't know. Maybe I should leave that inside grass, though. The infield grass. I could leave that. Because now it looks a little weird. But, oh, wait. Did we miss a little spot? No, we didn't. Okay. Perfect, and then we'll lift her up here. We're getting her done, boys. We're getting her done. Okay, sweet. Now we'll roll around here. This is going to be a sweet baseball diamond, dude. Okay, but we got to put the fences up. That's one thing we got to do. We got to make sure to put the fences up and the lights up. This thing at night is going to look so cool, too. There we go. We're getting everything. Perfect, and then, dude, these guys' this house is going to be so sick. Everybody's going to want to come over. All the neighbors are going to want to come over. There we go, we'll roll, roll, roll around here. And then it's going to kind of take away some of this mulch probably, but it's fine. Honestly, I'm, I think I, I think I did somewhat of a decent job. Okay, now we got to get clear of this grass just kind of right along the sand. Let's see if I can do it. Here we go. Nice job, nice job, nice job. Get, reach out, get that stuff. Perfect. Okay, we got that stuff. Now we got to get all along there too. I should have kept the grass. Definitely should have kept the grass. Bad decision on that, but fine. Okay, are we getting that stuff along there? Oh, we got it. Okay, we can't let that little little grass there. I gotta get it. I gotta get it. Okay, perfect. Right there. Okay, on. We gotta back up, and then go around through here. We get this little grass on the edge. Sweet, we got that. Okay, I gotta back up and straighten out a little bit. Okay, you know what we're gonna have to do is lift her up, and then get all this. Dude, I should have time lapsed this. Lapse this, dude. There's this guy on YouTube, he does time lapses, he should do this. He should build a baseball field and time lapses, that'd be kind of cool. Instead of, oh dude, what if someday YouTube has a feature where you can literally speed up the whole entire video with no audio. Like you can just speed it up to times, times like 500 and you could literally, say you were like squad, you got a boring video going right here, you could just watch a time lapse of me instead. That'd be sweet if YouTube rolls out a feature like that. Okay. Perfect. Oh, we kind of got tire tracks. Man, I should... It's only when we're backing up, too. Oh, man. Okay, I, so I should roll over those tire tracks we got going here. I got to make sure to do that. Because, yeah, it's creating tire tracks, and we don't want those in the middle of a baseball field. So, yeah, anywhere I drive, I got to roll over those things. There we go. We're getting them. Right over here. Okay, we got to back up a little bit. Get this. There we go. I do not want tire tracks. Should I leave the infield? I'm thinking I'm going to leave the infield. Yeah, we're going to leave that, like a different uh, shade, of, shade of grass. That'll be sweet. Okay, we did miss this little stuff over here. Oh, man. There's a couple tire tracks over there. Okay, we're going to pull through here and then back up and get those tiny little tire tracks. I got to have this thing perfect, guys. He's got to be perfect. There we go. Drop her down. We got the tire tracks. Okay, sweet. We got that. Now, I think it's time for the fence. I need to leave like a little a little spot where I can bring my tractor in here though. That's the thing. I need to put up a gate. So I'll probably put the gate up in the outfield over there. So 
Okay, fence, ram, or it should be, uh, you know what? It's placeables. Placeables over here. Oh, do we put up a, like a water tower too? That'd be cool. Okay, so the, it's a zombie fence for now. So, here we go. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay, there we go. Is it good? It should be somewhat good. Hopefully, I don't screw it up too bad. Oh, man. This is looking sweet. Okay, I gotta, I gotta put this all the way around. Come on. Oh, dude, we need a scoreboard. Okay, you guys can see my baseball field's a little thicker over here. I kind of screwed up on that, but it's cool. We're good. Okay, right there. Bend her all the way around. Oh, she's looking good, dude. I got to put up the light poles, though. Oh, man, this is, this is looking sweet. In somebody's backyard, we're building a baseball field for them. And we're getting paid good for this project, guys. We are getting paid good, man. Okay. We kind of got a fence in there. Some kid's going to sneak out or something. Oh, man. Can we not place this? Shoot. That's one thing. Okay. Well, this will be where I get in and out of the field with my tractor. Oh, man. Hopefully, I can get my tractor through there. Sweet. And then this is going to be the backstop right along here. I should probably make it bigger. Is there anything bigger? Oh. Oh, man. I mean, that's not really backstop. <laughs> okay. No. I don't think we can do that. Yeah, it's not gonna work. That's not gonna work too good. So this will have to be the backstop. It's it's cool. Okay, right there. Right there. Perfect. Okay, should I? Okay, maybe I'm gonna make a little gate on this end so I can get my tractor in now over here too. So that way we should be good. Okay, right there. So this is it's like just all chain and stuff. This is the baseball diamond so far. We need, okay, we need lights. We need lights. So, spotlights. Oh, man, this is going to be sweet. Okay. Oh, we do need a mound, too. So, yeah, good thing I left this in so I can get my, like, skid loader. I can get anything in there. So, we need lights on this field. I got to show you guys it at, at night. Medium or big? Let's go big, baby. Go big or go home. Okay, yeah, this isn't even too big. So, you can see where the light points. I think you can, yeah, there we go. Oh, it lights up this whole thing, dude. It lights up the whole thing. Okay, sweet. Oh, man. Can we go back in here any further? There we go. Can we go... Right... Right there? Okay. How many how many lights should we put, guys? What are you guys thinking? Okay. Right there. I'll have to see what happens in the night nighttime. Oh, man. Can I not put them... Okay. There we go. Light. Light. Oh, dude. This is looking sweet. Okay. I don't know. Hopefully, it can reach the middle of the field, too. That's one thing about it. It should be able to. Oh, man. This is farming simulator. We're building a baseball field. Holy crap. Okay. There we go. Oh, man. We can't put... Okay. We kind of have a ton of lights. I don't think you need this many lights, but this thing is going to be lit up at night, dude. There we go. We got them all in. Okay. So, this is the baseball field so far. What else do we need? Okay. The pitching mound, which I could just... Okay, I could just put a little dirt in for now. That'd probably work good. I want to put a nice little mound up, though. It'd be sweet if I could put a nice little mound, which means we got to go pick up a teeny bit of dirt. And to get dirt... Okay, you know what I'm going to do? <laughs> this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to run the skid loader down the road. This is what we're going to do, because we can go get dirt right over there. And we don't need much dirt at all. This will work perfect. See? I needed the bucket. Oh, we could just use mulch, too. But, okay, we got to get dirt, man. We can't just use mulch. There we go. This is the reason I need the bucket, guys. I didn't think of this, but there we go. So we're not even going to go far down the road. And the skid loader goes kind of quick. There we go. Okay, perfect. Speaking of going down the road with a skid loader, literally last weekend I was going down the road with a skid loader for a little bit. Had like five cars behind me. It was kind of insane. Everybody was a little mad. But uh, we're going to go put this thing under the... We're going to go purchase dirt. We're going to go purchase dirt over here. I wonder if there's, a, I think there's a dirt pile somewhere too around here, but it's fine. I can, I can just purchase it over here. This will work good, dude. Okay. By the way, if you're still that person that I said will watch the whole video and not skip a beat, I'll give that smack that like button. Tell me you're watching it, man. This is sweet that you guys are, are watching the whole thing without skipping anything. Um, okay. Dirt. Perfect. It filled it all the way up. We got a full bucket load of dirt. Sweet. There we go. And now we got to climb that hill back up to the house over there and put this mound down. I'm just going to pour the, all the dirt I got, which it should be a perfect mound, a pitching mound for the pitcher, if you guys know what I mean. So that the pitcher is kind of higher up and you get a little more elevation. gives them kind of, it gives them a lot more of an advantage too. 
Okay. Now we got to... Can I drive through the back? I don't want to drive through the back. Should I? Nah, we'll, we'll drive up through the side over here. Probably the best. Uh, you know what? Back... Er, can I get through there? Uh, I don't think I can. We're going to have to go through over here. Look at this thing. Okay, I'm going to run the clock so that way we can get there and I can show you guys too. Hopefully... Don't wait. Oh, shoot. Will the grass grow? I don't want this grass to grow. Well, I kind of want it to grow, I guess. Oh, man. We're tearing up. We're tearing up the field. Okay. Right in the middle here. I need some bases, too. I don't know how I'm going to put bases down. Okay, right. For example, I'll put, I'll put it a little further back. Keep dumping. Okay, that wasn't too good. What I'm going to do is I get from the side over here. And I got to, like, pile it up a lot better. I got to make it, like, kind of more of a mound than, like, just a flat little surface right there. Okay, we'll pile it up right through here. Sweet. Okay, now... Oh, dude, it looked a little better the way we had it, but it's fine. There we go. I'm going to take the edge over here and kind of pile it up. And this should work good. This is kind of a bad mound. Man, okay. We got her. Okay, now I'll really pile her up right here. There we go. Okay, I probably need... Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Sweet. Okay, that's going to work good. So here's the pitching mound. Your pitcher's right up here. And then to the batter over there. Perfect. Okay, we got a kind of a good mound. I don't want to... Man, I'm kind of tearing this thing up. Oh, man. Okay, take the same tracks in as you take out. Oh, man. Okay. There we go. Sweet. That kind of yeah, that kind of tore up the field a little bit, man. There we go. Perfect. We'll put this right here. Um, should we shut her off? Sweet. Shut her off. Okay. So, baseball field, dude. This thing looks so good, man. Okay. Oh, dude. What else should we put on it? I'm thinking it's good. I'm thinking I built one of the best baseball diamonds in Farming Simulator 2017. Should we go compare it to the other baseball diamond? Should I show you guys? Okay, quick. I'm going to take a little stroll, and I'm going to show you guys their diamond. And I'll see if there's anything else I should put on it. I could put a dugout. What would I... What could I do? Oh, dude, what if we place down a shed for a dugout? We could place down a shed, too. So, oh, man, that'd be sweet. Um, I don't know what type of shed we should, we should place down. Is that a dugout? That's what I'd probably put out as a dugout. I don't know. We, oh, we need bleachers. Oh, that's what we needed. Man, I, okay. Um, Do we have bleachers? We have bleachers. I'm going to get bleachers. We got to get bleachers. Okay, I'm back, and we got bleachers. So, bleacher right here, or we could just put bleachers all around the backstop here. So, if we go to placeables, I want I, I want these lights to kick on, because this is going to look sweet. Um, You know what? It's over here. Thank you. Shout out to Lambo. Lambo made these uh, Lambo mods. Bleachers. They're motocross bleachers, but it'll do good. So, should we just put them all the way along here? Thinking? Should work good. We gotta, oh man, I kind of screwed up on the light poles. There's kind of gonna be a light pole through the bleacher, but that's kind of normal. Sometimes that does happen. So we'll just put them all the way across here. Oh man, this looks, it makes it look so much. Oh, okay. oh shoot. <laughs> I didn't think about this for a second. I was like, man, we're building the best baseball field ever. But I didn't think about the fact that this is somebody's house. <laughs> okay, they probably didn't want bleachers at their house. Um, okay, we'll take away this this last bleacher over here. I did not think about that, dude. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, but they did not want bleachers at their house. Okay, but it makes it look a ton better, you gotta admit. So, we'll sell this uh this last bleacher over here. I should be able to sell it. There we go. Sweet. Uh, you know what? It makes it look a ton better with, with that bleacher over there. So, uh, we'll just put it back. Yeah, it looks a lot better if you put it back. So, we'll put it back all the way across here. They got bleachers at the house. They'll have to deal with it. They said they want a baseball field. They got a baseball field. Okay, and then the lights are going to kick on any second, and we got ourselves a baseball field. Now, the outfield's a little small. Oh, I didn't show you guys the other one. The outfield is definitely a little small here, but it's fine. So, we are going to make... Dude, we're going to... They're paying us $100,000 for this field, which is perfect. We need the money. We can buy more equipment, boys. We can buy some more equipment. Maybe I should have put the fence along here, but their their house is a good... Oh, I, I didn't really think about one thing. If they have, if somebody's up here to bat and then they got a foul ball right over here, they're probably most likely going to break one of these windows considering there's like 10 windows right here, but we're going to say they're bulletproof windows. Uh, they prepared for this. Perfect. That'll work. When does the sun go down on this map, boys? Oh, there we go. The baseball field is lit up. There's a little corner over here that may need it. I could, okay, what I could do, 
Oh, sweet, dude. This is going to look sweet. There we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do is add one more light through here. We go over to placeables. There should be one more light. Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Okay, this one. Big model. Over here. We can put this bad boy. Just kind of uh, pointing out there a little bit. So, there we go. So, it will it should light up that side a little better. Kind of light up the house over there. Do we need one more over here? Should we add one more? Would it help light up anything? Oh, I can't with the bleachers. Okay, but <laughs> there we go. It is completely lit up. This is a baseball diamond, so say I'm up here. I'm the batter. Oh, boy. Look at this thing. It looks great, and it's in somebody's backyard. I, I think this was successful, a successful project. It was a lot better than, than I thought it was going to be. It was a lot better than I thought it was going to be. So if you guys did enjoy this video, if you, th if you thought I did good, Drop a like, but guys. Uh, but anyways, guys, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching, brothers. I appreciate it. Thanks, guys.